hi welcome to macology in this video we are going to create a ball berry and for that we will create the first part and its name is outer ring let's create select the new and select the part and apply ok and now select the front plane and go to sketch draw two circles and now the dimension is it is 60 mm and the inner one is a 50 mm apply ok go to feature select extruded boss here select the mid plane and it is 14 apply ok select the right plane go to sketch draw one center line which is horizontal like that and select and now select the circle and draw one circle diameter of this circle is 11 and distance of this circle from the center line is 20 mm select this center and select with shape select this origin and make vertical now go to features and select the revolved cut and apply ok now just apply the appearance to it select here and select this polished steel here and now save it now we will create the second part which is inner ring let's create select the part and apply ok <coughs> select a front plane go to sketch select circle and do two circles the outer one has a 30 mm radius oh, sorry not radius it is diameter and the inner one is a 24 mm go to features and select extruded boss and here is a 14 mm with mid plane apply ok select the right plane go to sketch draw one center line which is horizontal like that and now select the circle select the smart dimension diameter of this circle is 11 mm and distance of this circle from center line is 20 mm and this center and this origin are vertical to each other now go to feature select a revolved cut and apply ok this is our inner ring just give it to appearance this is the appearance the polished steel and it is our second part save it now we will create the third part of it it is a ball select the new select part and apply ok select the front plane go to sketch and here select the center point arc and select the center line here select smart dimension radius of it is 5.5 .5. and select this center line and select this origin and make coincident now go to feature select the revolved boss apply yes and apply ok now go to appearance select this polished steel and it is our goal now we will create the fourth part and it is called a case one uh, let's uh, select the new and apply part and apply ok <coughs> now select the front plane go to sketch draw two circles the outer one has 41 mm diameter and inner one is a 39 mm diameter and apply ok go to feature select extruded boss and here select the blind one and it is 6.5 apply ok now select the right plane go to sketch and draw one circle like that and diameter of this circle is 11 mm apply ok go to feature select the uh, extruded cut and see here select through all apply ok now select the fillet 
select this face this edge and select this edge and here is 0 0.5 full preview apply ok now select uh, circular pattern and first we need to create the axis so here go to reference select the axis select this one and apply ok now we have axis now go to set, uh, circular pattern and select this axis and select these features and here select this cut x tool and select this fillet and apply ok now go to shell and select this face select this face and select this one and it is 1.5 show preview apply ok and we need to increase the instances so here is 8 apply ok now it is perfect now select this face and go to sketch select the circle and select the center line do center line like that and do one circle like that it is 0 0.5 and distance from the center is 20 apply ok and now go to feature and select the extruded cut and through all apply ok now again select the circular pattern select this axis here select 8 and here select the extruded cut and apply ok just hide it and it is our case number 1 now we will give it to appearance go to brass and select this polished brass and now save it now we will create the fifth part of it it is case number two select the new select part apply ok select front pen go to sketch it is quite similar to the page number one I'll draw two circles here select smart dimension it is 41 and it is 39 apply ok go to feature select the extruded boss and here is 6.5 apply ok select the right plane go to sketch go one circle select smart dimension diameter of this circle is 11 mm apply ok go to feature select extruded cut here select tool and apply ok now select the fillet select this edge and select this edge and the fillet is 0 0.5 now select the reference select plane axis select this one and apply this is our axis now select the circular pattern here and select this axis and now go to features and select this one and select this one apply ok <coughs> now select the shell select this face select this face and select this inner one and here is 1.5 show preview apply ok now select this face go to sketch select center line so draw one center line like that select row one circle here select smart dimension diameter of the circle is 
and distance from the center is 20 go to feature and select the extruded boss select blind and it is 2mm apply ok now see a circular pattern select this axis and here features select the extruded boss and select the 8 hide this axis and it is our case number 2 now we will apply to appearance select this polished brass and now it's our case number two and now save it and now we'll assemble it select the new select assembly apply ok here select the outer ring and now we will insert inner rest now go to mat select this one select this one and apply concentric select this face and select this face and make it coincident now we will insert the bowl and make sure bowl will be inserted between this uh, this two ring right just like that we need to put it like that now just a little bit like that now go to mat select this face and through it select this face and select the tension now select this face and through it select this face and apply tension now we are select the front plane of the outer ring and select the front plane of the bowl and apply ok now you can see it is rotated about this center right now insert the cage cage number one this is the cage and now <clears throat> select the mat select this face and select this one and make concentric apply ok now select this one and select this one and make concentric apply ok now insert the cage number 2 here select the rotate component and rotate it like that now go to mat select this outer face and select this one and select the concentric and apply ok now select this face and select this one and apply ok select this face and select this face and apply ok now select the axis in reference and select this one and apply ok now select circular pattern and here select in component select the ball and here instance is 8 make sure it is uh, uh, selected here equal spacing and it is our bearing Let's look like that 